Hello, this is my first vlog in 21. What a di different year I thought it was going to be, but it hasn't started that well, has it? With the lockdown. I have to say, this is a new type of variant. It is spreading a lot quicker. It's a lot easier to catch. So please do follow the rules. I know I say that every time, but it's really, really important that we do. Uh, we can't bring the country to, to a standstill and also we have to protect the NHS. It's, it's all full. I must do an operation on Friday and, and that's been cancelled because you know the, the, the NHS is overwhelmed with, with virus cases. But you know, it's still the same. Wear your mask, keep your distance and keep washing those hands. You can't wash those hands uh, 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 enough. So, I understand this this week there's been one or two uh, problems with emptying your bins uh, and the reason for that is that we have a lot of oper operatives off uh, sick uh, and one day last week there was 19. Now that sounds a lot but let me explain to you that if one member of crew gets the virus the others have to isolate. So therefore it's been very difficult which We've, we've been picking the bins up, we've been actually the next day going back and picking them up, but the brown bin uh, introduction uh, is, has been delayed. At the moment it's been delayed for a fortnight because we simply don't have the, the, the staff uh, uh, to, to recommence emptying the brown bins. But, you know, we've got to look on the positive side. Peterborough did well last year in, in getting money to modernise our city uh, and, and build the vision for it that uh, I think we all, all share, to make it a modern city which we're proud to, to, to live in. Uh, and, you know, that 2021 is going to be the same. They, we started to build the university uh, and we'll very shortly be putting planning application in for phase two of the university. Uh, Hilton Hotel is going a, a pace. The office block uh, on Flatten Keys for the government staff is, is going a, 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 a pace. North Menster will be putting a, a planning application in for that. So, you know, a lot of exciting stuff to go. So, you know, we need to look forward to that. Uh, but also, I, I'd just like to uh, uh, once again take this opportunity to thank all the council workers and staff and dedicated band and volunteers for their sterling efforts. And so many of our residents are key workers, doctors, nurses, police officers, social workers, supermarket workers, and, and, and you know, the list goes on. Thank you very much for what you're doing in, in these stressful and, and troubling times. If we all work together and we all stick to the rules, we will get out of this. Of course, the vaccinations uh, are, are on their way. Uh, I don't know the details yet, but we hope to uh, uh, next week I'll be able to tell you where, to, where you can get your vaccination and where you know, where, where they're actually going to take place, which we don't know at the moment. They're not decisions that we take locally, they're decisions that uh, uh, the Health Board nationally takes and tell us where, where they're going to go and where we're going to get them. And we don't know how many jumps we're going to get at the moment or, or where they're going to take place. But as soon as we do, we'll communicate that to you. Thank you very much.